Hi, my name is Kate Dimmock. I'm the fashion director of People Style Watch, and I'm here to introduce the first Kohl's shoppable Google Plus Hangout to celebrate the launch of Peter Somm's first collection for Design Nation. Hey, Peter, how are hey, you? how are you, Kate? Good. I want to tell people right away that they can shop some pieces while we're talking yep. today. Uh, to the right of the screen, you'll see some pieces that are already on the pre-sale, so start shopping. Um, and there'll be time to do a little Q&A, so we're going to get some questions. But fans should use the hashtag PeterSom for Coles to submit questions for Peter and I. So, Peter, how exciting is this? Launch April 10th. Mm -hmm. And I want to hear a little bit about the experience of designing for women at a different price point than you're used to. Peter's collection is generally a little more expensive than this, so this is a great moment for you. Completely. This has been such an exciting moment to design clothes at a great price point um, and still have them chic and feminine and gorgeous and with a little bit of fashion in there for every woman. It's really been an exciting moment. And later on we're going to talk about your inspiration of St. Bart's, which yes. is not bad, huh? And these clothes are $38 to $88. I mean, that's just it's astounding. You can't beat it. It's you a, really lot of, can't beat a lot it. of bang for your fashion buck. Exactly. And we are also going to be joined by three bloggers. Uh, we have Allison Cooper from Project Motherhood NYC. Hey, Allison, how are you? Hey, Allison. Hi, good. How are you? I'm so happy to be here today. Like Kate said, I blog over at projectmotherhoodnyc.com and I write daily about helping women accept their post-pregnancy body and always rocking their mama style. That's great. We love that. Um, and we also have Brittany Stewart from Fashion of Philly. Hey, Brittany. Hello. How are you? Good. Well, as I said, my name is Brittany Stewart. I'm from fashionoffilly.com where I blog about beauty, fashion trends, and exciting events happening in the area. And I'm very excited to be hanging out with you guys today. Thank you. We're so glad you're here. And lastly, we have Diana Burrows from The Budget Babe. Hey, Diana. Hi, everyone. I'm so excited to be part of this hangout. And uh, I blog at thebudgetbabe.com. It's all about affordable fashion. And I especially love to blog about celebrity looks for less and designer fashion trends for less. What, and what woman doesn't want to hear about that? Oh, completely. None. That's great. Um, now, Peter, I want to talk a little bit about your background. I've been following your career now for <laughs> more years than either of us care to mention. Um, but it's been over 10 years that Peter's had his own collection. And he's really known for sort of a feminine, quirky style, amazing use of bold print and color. And I'm a huge fan, along with lots of different celebrities. But I'd love for you to kind of tell people that aren't familiar with what you do a little bit about what you do. Well, like you said, I mean, I love beautiful feminine clothes. And for me, it starts with print and pattern and color. You know, ultimately, I think clothes should make you happy and make you feel fabulous. So that's what I've done for my collection, and that's definitely what I've tried to do for the Coles collection. And I want to also get into your inspiration. So was that your choice? Well, I am a beach bum at heart. So I do know that about you. Yes, and so I love being on the islands, and St. Bart's is one of my favorite places to vacation. It has the best of French chic style mixed with that laid-back island luxury that I love. Yeah. And uh, what better place to, uh, you know to uh, get inspired by. I'm inspired just hearing about it. <laughs> and I know, Peter, that you are an aficionado of French culture, and you're so good with that luxury look that the fact that you could bring it to the Kohl's customer for between $38 and $88 is pretty amazing. Yeah. I mean, for me, if you know, we've had a harsh winter. And we if, have if indeed. you can't get away to the beach literally, at least hopefully with this collection, you'll get take a little piece of the beach with you wherever you go. Exactly. And that's interesting about the timing of the launch of this collection is that it coincides with when a lot of people take spring break. Yeah. So, yes. you know, here you have your, your packing options right here. But exactly. Um, I want to talk to each blogger about sort of their feeling about the spring break options that are available through this collection. Allison, can we start with you? Yeah, of course. Unfortunately, I'm not vacationing anywhere this spring break. I'll be here <laughs> in the city. But, right, doing um, a staycation. I, yeah, staycation. But I'm obsessing with the romper, which I'm actually wearing right now, the striped romper. I feel like stripes are such a big trend right now, and this having the bold oranges in there just takes it to a completely different level. 
And yeah. um, I love adding a great belt around the waist to cinch it. Mm, and you can give perfect. it a little bit of an edgy look. It's so fun. Great from beach beach to restaurant, day to night. It's a great piece to have in your wardrobe this summer. Yeah. Very functional. Gorgeous, yes, but very super functional. functional. It's one of the most For versatile sure. pieces in the collection. I mean, like like uh, Allison said, you can really dress it up or dress it down, and it can go anywhere. Yeah, exactly. Um, Brittany, I'd love to hear what you were thinking about maybe you might take from the collection for sort of a spring bake break situation. Well, if I had the chance to get away, I think I would <laughs> definitely pack the eyelid shorts in white. They're really, really cute and classic. Also, the, yeah. the eyelid shirt in the orange. I love the color combination, just a bright pop of color. Um, also, it look, would look great on the beach or even if you're going out to lunch. Just really easy and effortless. Um, pair it with a pair of flip-flops or even some wedges at night, and I think you're good to go. Well, and I think that's true for a lot of these pieces. They're extremely versatile. I mean, we at People Style Watch, we always say, you have to think of three ways to wear something before exactly. you buy it. And, exactly. I, you know, you're more than halfway there right now, Brittany. Um, and lastly, Diana, I'm hoping you're going somewhere for <laughs> spring break. But talk to me about what you would what you would take with you. Sure. So I'm here on the East Coast, and I'll probably be doing a weekend getaway with my family. We love to go um, up to Maine and um, just you know explore the little quaint towns and hang out by the beach. So um, something that I'll definitely be bringing is the white moto jacket that I'm wearing oh, now today. Yeah, let's see. Um, oh, yeah. Love it. All about white for spring and summer. And mm -hmm. it feels so fresh after all the dark colors that we've been wearing. And this piece is so comfortable. It's really lightweight. It's really soft. It's easy to pack. It's easy to wash. So right. I could, you know, toss this over a maxi dress or a t-shirt and jeans. So it's really versatile. I love it. And I think it is. It's kind of, it's so good for vacation, but it's also has sort of an urban vibe to it too. You know, I think exactly. that's one of the more vers most versatile pieces in the collection. And it's also made out of jersey, which I, I loved the idea of almost designing something as comfortable as a hoodie. Yeah. But you still have that chic sensibility with a moto jacket, which is a. Mm -hmm. Packing way for spring break, and I love. love this print. This is one of my favorite pieces from the collection, I have to say. And Peter, you told me this great kind of little anecdote about this print when I saw you at the presentation. Yeah, this is based on this uh, postcard print that, mm -hmm. uh, this postcard uh, sort of map that we saw in St. Mm -hmm. Bart's. And, you know, I love the idea of sort of a fun, sophisticated, but kind of humorous print. And in this great maxi skirt, it, again, it's an easy way to wear a print and yeah. keep it easy and casual. I always feel like when I wear a maxi on vacation, that's the place that it makes the most, most sense. Do you know what I mean? Because you're not like dragging it through the city streets. Yeah. And it just feels so good when you're on yeah, vacation. Yeah, exactly. So I think we have a question Let's for you, see. Peter. Yes, here you go. Um, here's a question from Twitter, and this is at Mama Dear, and her question is, what keeps you inspired for new collections? She wants you already working ahead, I know, obviously. I know. <laughs> She's, she wants to keep you busy. Well, you know, for me, inspiration is everywhere. Um, I love travel, going to St. Bart's. I love theater. I love art. I was an art history major in college. So, you know, that's for me is the inspiration. Um, it really comes from just being in New York and seeing amazing people on the street, stylish women like you. Oh, thank and how you. you wear clothes. Thank you. Uh, it's really about reality um, and making that even more exciting than it already is. Yeah, that was a great question. Um, another topic that I really want to get to, because I think in this collection there are a lot of a lot of pieces that transition super well from day yeah. to night. Yeah. We've already kind of touched on that a little bit, but I'd love to get deeper into that. But first, Peter, like what to you are some of the pieces or one of the pieces that you feel transitions the best? Well, I mean, I, when I designed this collection, it really was the idea of addressing a woman's busy life. So it's not only 9 to 5, it's 5 to 9. Yeah. So with a change of accessories, you know, with a switch out of a shoe, maybe a little bit of a darker eye, you can really take it into evening. One of my favorite pieces is the little moto vest. Ooh. And it has a striped lapel. For me, a stripe is a neutral. Uh -huh. And it's black, and you can really yeah. layer it. Right here. Um, here it is. Layer it with a pencil skirt and for day, and mm -hmm. then you can, you know, put on something like another a killer pair of heels 
and it can go right out into the evening, and yeah. it's, I love it. Well, you know what else I would say about this, too, is it's such a key layering piece, even going into fall. Like, oh, you could definitely. throw this under a jacket. I think it's, I love this. I think it's an amazing, amazing part of the collection. And again, it's also made out of jersey, so it's packable, it won't wrinkle, it'll be as comfortable as your hoodie, Yeah. Um, but you'll feel sharp and snappy. So much chicer, yeah. you know, exactly. so much, and so much more feminine. I'd love to, uh, to talk to you bloggers about some of the items that you feel are super transitional that way and what you would do to make a day look into an evening look. Should we start with you, Allison? Sure. For this category, I'm loving the black knit pant. I think it's so easy breezy. I can really picture myself even throwing it on over my bathing oh, suit at the beach and then we're going straight into evening. It will look great with the vest that Peter recommended, but it also great. looks great with just your favorite fitted tee, a great statement necklace, and you can't forget your killer heels. Well, we I were talking before, perfect. too, yeah, about how that effortless feeling is so nice when you're, during the summer, you don't want to feel like you tried super hard, and that's such a key piece to getting that look. You need kind of a loose pant to sort of exactly. make it feel like you're comfortable. You're so much sexier when you feel comfortable, you know? Definitely, and this pant in particular, it's almost like your little black dress, but your little black pant. Exactly, your really LBP. Exactly, exactly. <laughs> um, now, Brittany, tell me which piece do you feel like you could take from day to evening really, really well? Well, Kate, I'm kind of with you on the maxi dress. I really love maxi dresses. They're so easy and effortless. Mm -hmm. The black and white striped one is really, mm -hmm. I really love that piece, especially um, the sheer panels at the bottom. I think it's really, really cute how you can yeah. still be really cool and comfortable while you're on vacation. Um, and at night, I would pair it with the moto jacket, and I think it would be really nice to pair it with the moto jacket just to keep it comfortable even more um, with a pair of like flip-flops, like again, or even wedges, um, just something comfortable and it can last all day in. Yeah, I love that. I mean, I think you could do that with a heel, but you could also do it with a little flat sandal. Oh, totally. I mean, it's, it's really cute. And that, again, I think you could wear that into early fall really super easily. Completely. I mean, black and white is a classic color combination, and you can never go wrong. And this is definitely something that's seasonless. You can take it right into fall. Yeah, for sure. Um, and now, Diana, let's hear from you. What would you take from day to evening in this collection? Um, I, I think so many of the pieces, you know, can transition from day to night, but one piece I love especially are the printed loose fit trousers, um, mm. the print pants. This is a big trend that you're seeing on celebrities now. I just love it because um, for day, you could pair it with something like a casual tank top and a jean jacket and your favorite mm. you know, gladiator sandals or flip-flops. And then for night, you could swap out the top for a silky blouse or, you know, bring back the moto jacket and your favorite pair of heels. And I think it just, it's just got that cool vibe, but also so relaxed and something, well, you know. And the fabric has a little sheen to it, which is really nice. You know, it feels yeah. a little luxurious, for sure. That touch of luxury and that ease of that pant, I think it's a, a really great combination. Yeah, I love it. And actually, we were just talking up at the office how pineapples, <laughs> pineapples are really big for summer. How did you know? Well, you know, in, in the Caribbean, a pineapple is a traditional sign of welcome. So I wanted to incorporate oh, that's so neat. pineapples in there and that print. And also, we have a t-shirt with a great uh, pineapple print on it. Right. It's a fun, fun little. Uh, it know, is. It's like a, that's a cute. It's kind of classic in a way, but it's cute. It's yeah, fun. It's exactly. playful. So I think we have another question. Oh yes. Yeah. Here you go. Um, so Twitter user E Seattle Mama wants your favorite color to incorporate this season. Well, for me, the favorite color is a pop of coral. Uh, as much as I love every color in the rainbow, and in this collection, we do have shades of blue and white and black. I love a coral because it's almost like a pink, but it's a little bit warmer, and it's just it's it's really rich. And there's an easy ways to just incorporate it in a simple blouse or even in a great accessory. So I would try that as the new color for the season. And you know, I have to say that coral flatters a lot of different skin tones. That yes. is a color that ba it basically it's like a makeup color. So yes, exactly. almost any woman can wear that color. So yeah. that's a really good choice. And it's also bright, but not sh shockingly bright. Exactly. So. Yeah, no, I love that idea. Um, so another topic that we've been talking about is 
while we all would love to live I know. in the spring break St. Bart's world, unfortunately some of us have to go back to work and taking care of kids and running around, so we wanted to talk also about how some of these pieces and which pieces you feel would best address a woman's busy everyday life. Well, for me, it was so important to think about not just lying at the beach, which we all want to do, right. um, but uh, everyday life and going to work and dropping off the kids and everything. So I really wanted to make sure there were pieces in this collection that addressed that. One of the pieces that I think is super versatile is the um, the jumpsuit. Yes, oh, I'm going to grab that. It's a black jumpsuit oh, that you know really can go anywhere. Mm -hmm. um, and. Not only that, there are other great pieces like dresses that are made out of knit uh, that, you know, have a little bit of a, you know, more of a dressed feeling, but they have the comfort levels. Well, and I think that I personally love wearing jumpsuits, and part of what I love about it, it feels, I feel really modern when I wear a mm -hmm. jumpsuit. I feel really kind of sexy and modern, but it's also the ease of putting on a dress. Like, it's a little bit sort of chicer than just wearing a dress, yeah. and yet, you, it's the same thing. You put it on and you're done. You just yeah. throw on some accessories and you're good to go. It's which zip it up and go. You, it's which just, is what you want when it's warmer out. You want to yeah. be able to just get out the door. Um, can I ask some of you bloggers, what are the items that you feel like you could take into your everyday life? Should we just start with you again, Allison? Please talk to me about what you would get for your own busy life as a mom and beyond. Sure. So I love the black and white stripe fit and flare dress. Yeah, this was um, a piece that Coles had sent to me, and I actually wore it yesterday, and I feel like it's so polished. And mm -hmm. I paired it with a turquoise belt around the waist to give it a little pop of color, which was really fun. But I think you can even wear it with a flat during the day and then pair it with a great heel at night. It's just a fun, easy breezy, really comfortable, chic look. Well, and I have to say that that is a shape that really flatters every woman's body type. That's something that we're always mm -hmm. talking about at People's Style Watch is how do you find that universally flattering dress? And this one is it. That shape, as long as you're kind of getting somebody's waist, mm -hmm. you're really hitting her at her smallest point in her body, and that always looks good on everyone. And again, you can never go wrong with black and white. And this per particular dress, again, is a stretch. It's a jersey. So you have you know, the, the fit, and you have the comfort. Yeah, no, it, I, th I think that's a great choice. Um, Brittany, what is a dress, or any of the pieces actually from the collection, that you think you could incorporate into your everyday life? Well, I'll go with the dress that I have on now, which is the Charmeuse halter dress. Um, it's really, really cute, and it has the striped black and white at the bottom of the hem, which I really love because it adds a mix of the, the patterns again. Um, also, you can just layer it with a, a blazer if you're going to work or you know, any, anything, um, a sweater or a cardigan. It's very versatile, and you can put on some booties or like a heel if you're you know, in the workplace, and it's just, it works well. Yeah, again, it has that real kind of luxe feel to it. Yeah, it's, it's a silk charmeuse, and what's great about this print, it's, also, it's, it's a delicate print that can really work in the city. It can work anywhere. Yeah. No, I love that one. Um, Diana, is there something from the collection that you feel like you would be able to transition to your everyday life? Yeah, absolutely. Um, like Peter said, I think that stripes are neutral, so I'm loving all the stripes in the collection, especially uh, the blue and white dress. It's Ooh, got that's a good sort of nautical feel, which I love being on the East Coast. And, um, and it's that stretch fabric again, so you could wear it, I could wear this, you know, while I'm walking, you know, going for a walk with my dog and my son, or I could wear it to brunch, and I think it's all about the accessories that I switch out to make it, you know, dressier or more casual. Well, and it's already working with your white motorcycle jacket that clearly oh, Shirley has, completely. you know, we've, we've already decided you're buying that, so you need this dress too, obviously. And also stripes for me are neutral. Stripes are seasonless, you can wear them anywhere, literally anywhere, and you'll always look crisp and polished and perfect. Yeah, and I think if you are a little bit bolder with your style, it's really nice to mix stripes and patterns. Exactly. It's such a great look right now, and exactly. I think it, you can kind of customize your look with that. Completely. So again, I think we might have another question for you. OK, this is from, from Twitter as at Mrs. Christie. And she wants to know, how long have you been designing clothes? How did you get your start? 
Well, how long do we have? No, I'm <laughs> kidding. Uh, I started sketching when I was a kid. So I knew probably since I was 10 years old that I wanted to do fashion. I've been doing my own line for over 10 years. It's been really a dream come true. And to be able to do something that I love is really what makes this all worth it. And I think that's just in life. Do what you love. Yeah, I mean, and I think the fact that you enjoy designing in the process is really evident in the clothes that you make. I mean, as you said earlier, you make clothes that make women happy. And I know, because I've worn your collection, both the Kohl's collection as well as mm -hmm. the other, that it really, that's true. There's something about it that just makes you feel joyful. Um, so now I want to talk about everybody's favorite pieces from the collection. And of course, Peter, I first, want, first up, I want to know what your favorite piece from the collection. My favorite piece in the collection is something we've already touched on. That's but okay. It's, it's the white moto jacket, yeah, uh, actually which is actually that. available uh, on pre-sale today. Uh -huh. Again, it's uh, it's right there. It's is the, it? the, oh, yeah, the long oh, Yeah, I actually yeah. put it back where it belonged. That's someone um, like me. Again, you know, moto, the moto trend is not going away. And this is a way to do it in a great, easy jersey sweatshirt material, basically, with, you know, with this great little touches of gold hardware. Yeah. And you can put, roll it in a ball, put it in your suitcase. You can wear it from day to evening, again, with a change of accessories, like we said. And I feel like this piece will take you literally 9 to 5, 5 to 9, from now until September. Yeah, I mean, coming from an editorial point of view, the moto jacket shape is sort of the new blazer. Like, I think that it it just puts a fresh spin on anything you pair it with, yeah, and yeah. it really can function the same way you might have worn a little black jacket, oh, you know, completely. proper blazer, you know, a, a, a six months ago. Yeah, yeah. So now my personal favorite, because I know you want to uh -huh. know, is the dress I'm wearing, yes. which I really love. I think the pattern is so divine, and I really believe that the shirt dress is such an important shape for spring. I think that this is such a great option because of the print you can mix it like I could throw like a little t-shirt oh, underneath this it's so so versatile and I know there was another Kate that likes it oh yes yeah yes. I saw that because obviously yes. through work I know Kate Bosworth has also worn this dress she has I mean she's one of my favorite actresses and I love her style so I told Coles please reach out to her and see if she can wear this dress and she paired it with a little booty and little sunglasses. I love the way you're wearing it with Thank this you. gold necklace, which <laughs> feels like the islands. And you know, again, like you said, a shirt dress is a classic shape, but adding it into this print it gives it that little special twist that can take you anywhere. Okay, well, I think we're almost out of time. I want to say goodbye to our bloggers very quickly. Diana, thank you so much for joining us. Thank you so much for having me. Brittany? It was a pleasure. Thank you pleasure. for being wow. here. Thank, Thank you so much for having me. Bye, Peter. Bye, Love Kate. the dress. Looking good. <laughs> Thank you. And lastly, Allison, thank you for being here. Bye, everyone. Thanks for having me. Thanks, thank you so much. So, and thank you, audience, for joining us. And please remember, shop for Peter Cole, Peter Som. Oopsie, I just changed. <laughs> Peter Som for Design Nation. The presale at Coles.com starts today, and then the complete collection will be at stores starting April 10th. Thanks, Peter. Thanks, Kate.